Welcome brothers and sisters, welcome to a new video of Triple Chris. My name is Michael, I'm the founder of Triple Chris and the Righteous Pass Movement Foundation. And today we will talk about the Gospel of the Kingdom. Focus on Kingdom purposes alone. Many people are stopping, stopping at the cross and saying that's all. But that was not all. His ministry had finished and he set us free from the death penalty of sin. But then what about his resurrection? What about the 40 days he walked with him? We walked with his apostles. What about the ascension to heaven? What about the falling of the Holy Spirit? Brothers and sisters, if you say everything is finished at the cross, you're missing out on the main experience of the kingdom of heaven. The power that lies in the re resurrection, the power that lies in the 40 days, the calling forth into your new destiny, into your new level that came during the 40 days when the Lord asked his apostles to feed my sheep. You're missing out on it. You are declaring the cross an idol. And you are not continuing, you are not receiving the power and experience the kingdom of heaven yourself. The power of the kingdom was not the miracles and wonders that Jesus did on earth. The power of the kingdom of heaven was the resurrection. His new body, his powerful body. And it was his ascension. And it was the coming down of the helper, the Holy Spirit that fall on the apostles so that they could feed the, his sheep and spread the gospel of the kingdom and no other gospel. You are focusing on salvation alone and you're missing out on the kingdom. You are not climbing to the new level, the kingdom level. You are not coming out of the graves. You are not coming out of the world and out of Babylon. The grave is a clear pattern. You are not overcoming sin by resurrection. You are not overcoming the evil side by re resurrecting from the dead, but being alive now, alive on a new level, on the kingdom level. The time has come, brothers and sisters, for you to focus on the kingdom alone. The Lord is calling you now from the outer court, from the co outer court where, of, where it was about the cross about re repentance, about sin, about everything. Out of that, he calling you now into service for him, into the holy place. He is calling you now as a royal priesthood to serve him as a perfect vessel in the line of David, the royal priesthood, a co-heir of the kingdom. He is calling you now into the position that he himself walked before. But he overcame death. He overcame the enemy for us to give us that great example. Now it's our time to come out of the world and out of Babylon and to focus on the heavenly kingdom alone. Brothers and sisters, where did Jesus find his apostles? back into his career, back into the world, because they had given up hope on Jesus because he was in the grave. And then when he was with them in the lake of Tiberias, he told them, come, I show you how to fish, 153 fish, and now you come, and now you become fish of men, and now you become my people, and now you go forth and feed my sheep. And they never returned back into fishing. They left the world. They left their families, they left their careers, they left everything what they had, forever. And they went on the new level, now serving the Lord in the holy place. That's exactly what the apostles did, serving the Lord in the holy place. And to do that perfectly, they received the Holy Spirit. They focused on kingdom purposes only, on nothing else. And this is a new level, this is a level that we have to walk in right now, brothers and sisters to experience the kingdom of heaven and to bring down heaven onto the earth. 
by establishing sanctuaries, holy places for God. The embassies of heaven where you as ambassadors and all his staff will work together as a royal priesthood. And where great lights will be established and great revival will come forth. Where you will go into unity out into the neighborhood to fulfill the commandment of Jesus Christ to love your neighbor as yourself. To go out and to bring in the harvest of the ages. This is a resurrection level. This is a level after the death. This is a level of freedom. When you are finally be set free from everything of this world. When you can focus 100% on God alone, on his kingdom. When you show forth the principles of heaven, of love, mercy and compassion. When you go out into the neighborhoods and gather the people together as the apostles did in Acts 1.0. But now we are Acts 2.0, walking in the latter reign, in the former reign together. In a greater outreach to the whole world establishing the holy places in all the nations and on all continents. Focus on kingdom purposes only. This is the resurrection level of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. That's the reason why the Lord is here for 40 days, to give out the mantles and position as he has done in the times of old with his apostles. He will come knocking at your door and say, you are chosen, feed my sheep. And you will do in a greater way, not in the way of the apostles, but now in the new way, in the end time movement of the Lord. As it is written here in this image, and thanks for the creator of this image, don't settle for salvation only, experience the kingdom of God. This is the resurrection level, this is the access to the holy place. To experience now the kingdom of God here on earth. To establish the holy places. To walk on holy ground. The new intimate level with the Lord together. To walk with him every day. To experience his power and his glory. To let your light, light shine that can never be shown in the churches. Because they are stopping at the cross. But this is just the beginning. Now we are walking on that new level and everything is for kingdom purposes only. Brothers and sisters, let us bring down heaven onto the earth and establish the holy places in your neighborhoods so that the people can drawn to the light and that they can be drawn not only to the cross but to the full ministry and to the new level, to the kingdom of God. Let us bring back the prodigal sons and daughters to the king. Let us help that they return their hearts back to the father. Our time has come. Join us, be part of Triple Kiss. And thank you that you have listened to this video. I hope I will see you again in the next one. Be blessed in the Lord and protected against any scheme that the enemy will bring against you. Amen and Amen. Maranatha.